Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Coffee with Craig show. We'll be talking about commercial real estate in Central and Eastern Europe. So good Friday morning, ladies and gentlemen, and uh, welcome to the Coffee with Craig show. We are weekend ready, and Winston, I see you're ready to for the beach, yeah? I'm ready for the weekend. You're I'm not sure I'm going to the beach this weekend. Not going to the beach? What, no. Any no. big plans? I've got a run on Sunday, half marathon. Mm. So uh, that's going to be quite exciting. So Saturday, big night out and then straight to the marathon? Big night, big night, uh, rehydrating, uh-huh, resting, uh-huh. Uh, fueling myself. Eating your carbs or whatever yeah. whatever you guys do. Get half marathon. Wow. Warsaw? Yeah, just outside of yeah. Warsaw. Yeah. Oh, nice, nice. Quite, right. quite local. But it should be cool weather. It should be cool weather for the 13 running. degrees, apparently. 13? Oh, oh. Ooh, that's Warming good. up. Yeah, that's know. really nice. Well, we are weekend ready here at the Coffee with Craig show. A lot of interesting things going out. I was just taking a look at our uh, I was just taking a look at our pages on LinkedIn and uh of course the Europa property page which has been up uh for quite a long time now we've got a, we've got 5000 over 5000 uh subscribers so uh quite a lot of uh regular readers of the um uh, the news and we've got 1300 uh subscribers just for that are getting the coffee with Craig show every day so just off of LinkedIn to start. Uh, of course, a lot of other people on my own, uh, over th- always at 30,000 for, for many years now. But yeah, so it's growing every, uh, you know, every day, every month, some new. Uh, yeah, so it's obviously a popular outlet. Yeah, yeah. It just, uh, just keeps growing and growing. Uh, Coffee with Craig show. Thank you for watching. You know, after, uh, after lockdown, I thought, well, no one's going to watch this. And they keep watching more and more. You keep, you keep plugging the content. You keep pushing it out. Yeah, you know? and I guess the amazing news you're putting out, everyone wants to hear That's about right, it. Yeah, yeah? Just, just turning up. Thinking about that, let's talk about the headlines, yeah? Yeah, okay. So uh, uh, fresh off the press today, we've got mm-hmm. uh, Privy Ritalny Fond is expanding its portfolio in Croatia. Uh, Bright Spaces is digitalizing ELI Park's entire portfolio in uh, Romania. Uh, CTP is expanding its Warsaw uh, Industrial and Logistics Park by 67,000 square meters. And uh, also in Poland, Ideal Idea is expanding its city park, Wrocław development. Ideal Idea. That sounds like a very good name. Sounds like a good idea. Yeah, it sounds like a very good idea. Anyway, a lot happening today. We got uh, two new sponsors for our Baltic Awards and the Baltic Real Estate Awards taking place May 23rd in uh, in Sopot, which is part of the Tri-City area, northern Poland, on the um, Polish Riviera, Baltic Sea. Uh, we've got Enorbis, which is an amazing wine company in uh, in German in, in Austria. So in Germany, in Austria, uh, great great sparkling wine. We had it at the uh, had it at the uh, the retail awards, and huge huge response. Uh, very nice. Went through, I think. Record number of bottles, so people must have liked it. So they're happy to cooperate for the Baltic Awards. They're yeah? happy to cooperate for the Baltic Awards. So we'll have some great sparkling wines uh, from Austria, from May Norbus, and uh, red and uh, red and white wines, of course, from them again. So great to see it. Uh, the Quest Group uh, has also joined us for the Baltic Awards as an award sponsor. They're a boutique investment uh, investment firm here in um, in Poland for uh, some all kinds of interesting uh, real estate investments. So interesting that some news uh, news for the for the day on those events. Uh, Romania, very big uh, the SCE awards, which is actually taking place before that um, April 17th at the uh, Athenium Palace in Bucharest. Also very exciting. Uh, a lot of sponsors coming in there. A lot of uh, jury members already being announced. I see every day from our team here. So that's April 17th. Uh, we're at this Anthony Palace. If you are planning to come book your tickets or corporate table right away, it's a little bit smaller ballroom than we're normally used to using. So we will be sold out. Get your place. Um, coming up two weeks is, uh, is Midman. Surprising, yeah. It's right yeah, around it's, the corner. It's, it's right around the corner. Yeah, we're, we're the end of April, yeah. uh, end of February now. So uh, end of February is end of Fe- yeah. It's getting the end of February, yeah. so it must be coming. Yeah, um, magazines going to print today. Wow, great, great. So no wonder you have the weekend off. Yeah, magazines done and a couple yeah. weeks off. Yeah. Celebrate by running. All right, yeah, exactly. So got the magazine going. The Europa Europa Property uh, Ultimate Real Estate Guide, which we've uh, been. Um, Media partners of MIPIN now for Central Eastern Europe, Southeastern Europe for over 20 years. 
And of course, once again, happy to be there. We will have a stand as we always do. And our cocktail party will be on the stand and it's um, on the Wednesday, Wednesday at two o'clock. So put that in your calendars, pop by the stand. We're down in the, uh, they call it the bunker. We're down in the bunker and minus one. So uh, it doesn't sound so nice when you, when you say like, that. Yeah, let's, we'll call it, we'll, let's call it the Riviera. Well, it's not even the Riviera room. Let's, on the, on the terrace. It? The, the stand terrace. on the terrace. The terrace underground. Near yeah, the, terrace. the underground terrace. We're at the underground terrace minus one. A uh, lot of nice, a uh, lot of nice wines. We've got some also for those of you that aren't drinking. Um, I guess we've ordered some water and Diet Coke. But uh, very, very nice uh, um, reds, whites. Um, so nice, nice way to kick things off. So and rosé, super rosé. I think it's going to be more rosé day. And is this provided by Norbis as well? or No, this is provided by us. But I think Norbis will have some sampling going on there from what they what they keep telling us. So very exciting. If you get there early, get there at 2 o'clock, you'll get some of the A. Norbis uh, champagnes, as long as we don't drink it for... <laughs> Gary's going. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So pick up a copy of the, uh, the Real Estate Guide. Come to our SEE Real Estate Awards in, in Bucharest on April 17th. And, of course, the Baltic Awards coming up May 23rd in... Uh, the Polish Riviera in Sopot, between, uh, right between uh, Gdansk and Gdynia. So now we'll take a little break. Uh, this week is sponsored by the Quest Group, so you probably see a couple of ads from them. And, of course, we did a great interview uh, earlier this week um, with, uh, with the CEO, Se- uh, Severin. So uh, you take a look at that. And uh, he's been posted lots of, lots of views on this interview, so I think a lot, a lot going on. And we'll take a little break and we'll come right back uh, with Winston Norman in the news. Okay, so we're back. Uh, We hope you enjoyed our uh, little commercial. And, of course, we want to thank um, the Quest Group for sponsoring this week. We've got a few few more weeks available before summer, and we're filming at MIPIN. So if you'd like to be part of, if you'd like to um, uh, be a partner with us on the Coffee with Craig show, let us know. We've got uh, five or six interviews already done, and we have two or three more slots available and I think three more weeks before summer hits. So a great time to uh, to run uh, run some marketing before before uh, before everyone goes on a holiday. So uh, Winston, a um, lot of interesting uh, headlines there. Um, let us know what you got. Uh, let us give us more detail. Okay, thanks, Craig. So um, Privy uh, Relitny Bond has started its activities in the Croatian market, and they've acquired a plot of land which is going to be intended for industrial and logistics development. And it's near the Croatian capital of Zagreb. Uh, the land area is 9.7 hectares, and uh, it's going to, they're going to build around 45,000 square meters of leasable area. And according to uh, Tomas uh, Tribula, uh, transaction manager, uh, we see Croatia as our next market due to Croatia's recent entry uh, into the EU monetary union. The logistic market in this country is severely undersized, with great potential to catch up with other countries in the Central European region, which opens the door to new opportunities. And uh, the entire project will be implemented through a joint venture, which is very popular these days. And the partner in Croatia is Promat Investments. So a lot going on in Croatia the last, uh, uh, a lot of press releases coming out of Croatia, it seems, over the last few weeks. Yeah, yeah. And uh, it seems that Croatia, you know, is in need of some modern logistics and industrial development. And so there must be many good opportunities there, I would imagine, around Zagreb. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, Moving to Romania, and uh, Bright Spaces is launching uh, into the real estate vertical with its online 3D visualization solution for industrial spaces. And it's entering the logistics sector. Uh, and its first partner is ELI Parks, um, industrial platform in Romania. And uh, they are going to, uh, as part of their innovation and the adoption of sustainable and efficient work practices, uh, ELI uh, is going to incorporate uh, this digitalization process 
uh, for all its projects. And according to Andrzej uh, Jetzer, Manager Director of ELI Parks in Romania, in a world that changes fast, ELL Parks remains a pioneer of innovation in the logistics and industrial field. Our partnership with Bright Spaces is a significant step towards digitalization of the company's processes, bring a new dimension to the presentation of our spaces. Well, it sounds like a lot of interesting thing, a lot of cutting edge going on there, maybe something for right. our innovation awards at the SCE. Yeah, definitely. And well. uh, yeah, so this, this Bright Spaces, they offer the, like, like with offices and residentials, they offer, mm -hmm. they offer the chance that potential tenants can can get a walk through the, mm -hmm. the the projects before actually going there. Yeah, and ELI they've won a few awards over the years at our at our SEE awards. So good yep. to see that they're cutting edge and things are, you know, uh, some more innovation on the on the warehousing side. And staying in the industrial and logistics sector, moving to Poland, and CTP has expanded uh, in the Polish capital warehouse market of Warsaw with more than sixty seven thousand square meters. Uh, they're delivering two new buildings in CT Park, Warsaw South. Uh, the completion. This completion means that the this complex is now ninety percent complete, and in terms of energy efficiency, uh, the new buildings will offer uh, the latest standards for uh, sustainability, and uh, which will reduce pollution levels and save up to around fifty five percent of electrical consumption uh, in the external common areas. And according to Daniel Soban, business developer at CTP. We are offering a new facet to this location through ready-made solutions that facilitate the start of manufacturing activities. And when fully complete, this business park, which is located around 50 kilometers from Warsaw, will consist of three buildings offering around 162,000 square meters of leasable space. Well, it's a big project, yeah? Another big project mm -hmm. around Warsaw, and uh, yeah, they keep, they keep developing them and they keep building them. Yeah, and yeah, uh, yeah there's obviously a great need for this kind of yeah. last mile. Mm -hmm. You can see uh, CTP doing a lot more in Poland, as they mentioned yeah, they've last got, year. They've got yeah. a substantial land bank, and mm -hmm. uh, obviously, you know, the developments moving forward. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, finally, for today, staying in the as well as in the industrial and logistics in sector, and uh, developer Ideal Idea is commencing the construction of his fifth facility in the expansion of City Park Rotswav. Uh, this is located next to the airport in this lower Silesian capital, and it's going to deliver around fifteen thousand square meters of uh, new new space and uh, the total space offered by the park will then be 36,000 square meters. And according to Andrzej Dujaniski, CEO of Ideal Idea, the location of City Park Rotswav uh, at a strategic point between Warsaw, Berlin and Prague is crucial for attracting investments and increasing business value. Our offer of flexibility and quality of service is unmatched, making City Park Rotswav an ideal place for innovative businesses and the new building is targeting the international bream uh, construction standard and uh, the development is expected to be ready by the first quarter of 2025. Well, Wrocław always a good place to open logistics with all the factories around there I would imagine. Yeah, and it's obviously very clo closely uh, located to, to Germany. So also you know good. supply supply chains and everything then yeah, a very good location I would imagine. Excellent. So it was it was kind of a uh, industrial day today. Indust Friday is industrial Friday day. Friday is industrial day. There we go. Starting a new uh, a new trend. Yeah, we get a lot of industrial logistics uh, coming news. in on coming in on Friday morning. Good, good. What's well, exciting stuff? So, anyway, thank you all for watching the Coffee with Craig show this Friday, and also thank you for just showing that we have more and more viewers every every month. Every month, and new people coming, and I think more people just watching every day. So. Enjoy the weekend. Uh, we will see you Monday morning. Um, a lot happening next week, a lot going on, a lot of final deals uh, happening before MIPIN. So uh, keep us in mind. We definitely, we've got a couple of stand partners as well for the cocktails. So if you're looking to do something last minute to promote yourselves at MIPIN, we can also do things at the, our stand. So enjoy the rest of the day and we will see you Monday morning with the news. Click here to subscribe to the Coffee with Craig show and don't forget to share it with your friends.